fridge for us then. You want a hug? Sure. Let's go. This dress will fit her mom. This will be a perfect gift for her. Yes, I like it too. I think you should give her a bag. She can use it. Mm, I think Riley's right. Come on, let's go to the bag section. Hi babe, I miss you. That's why I called. How are you? What? You have fever? I'll be there. Okay? Ate, Kat, I need to go. Kat is sick. But we will buy back instead. No, we can do this. Besides, we're girls, right? We will know what a girl wants, right? Thank you for your understanding, Kat. You're welcome. Bye. Bye-bye. Is there something wrong? No, nothing's wrong, especially when we 
friend. Doc, I'm Kathleen. I'm his best friend and we are here to know what is the problem with his eyesight. Oh, why? Is there something wrong, Riley? Uh, yes, Doc. This past few days, I lost my eyesight and then suddenly it goes back to normal. Oh, no. Let's go. Let's check it out. I'm sorry, Riley, but your full eyesight was infected by your eye disease. Wait, what? Eye disease? But how? Oh, Trixie, I thought you'd know this. Your brother has a corneal disease and it caused him to be blind. Huh? Blind? Riley? I'm sorry, Ate, but I don't want you to worry. That's why I didn't tell it to you. But Riley, I'm your sister. I'm sorry, Ate. I'm sorry, Chicks. It's okay, though. I'm trying to call all the iBank uh, to have a donor. Just don't lose hope, okay? And one thing. Don't leave your brother alone. You have to be on his side always. Your brother needs you the most. Thank you very much, Doc. Chicks, what's wrong? What happened? Your mom called and asked me why your brother didn't answer her calls. 
The doctor said riding a scurvy dog is risky. He's blind now, and he really needs to find a donor. Oh man! Don't worry, I'm sure you will find a donor. I hope so. Ate, please call Kelsey and tell her what happened. Okay. Just go here now. Riley is sick. He needs you. Okay, bye. Is she coming? Oh, that's Kat. Ghost is not answering. But don't worry, I'll text her. Come here now. Riley needs you. Oh my god! My phone! Yeah? Yeah, yeah? Just go to the mall and buy my new phone. My phone is broken. It won't start. Let me see, ma. Yes. It already started. Thanks, but still buy me a new one. Just use my card. Okay. Thank you. He has corneal disease. He needs an eye donor. You can do it. You must fight, okay? We will do everything to find a donor. Thank you, Bess. Kat, I need to go to the office. I have an appointment. Will you please take care of Riley? No, I'm okay. No, you're not. Go ahead. I will take care of him. Thanks, Kat. You must change now. Yeah. I'm his best friend. Yeah, you're just only his best friend. And I'm his girlfriend. Know your position on his life. So I think you must cut your feelings for him. What are you talking about? I can see it the way you look at him. You love him, don't you? More than a friend. No, you're wrong. <sighs> don't deny it. Don't assume that he will like you because he is mine. So you better get off my baby. I'm sorry, babe, but I wasn't able to go here immediately. It's okay. Where is God? Did you see her? She went home. Went home? By the way, how are you now? I'm okay. Riley, Kathleen's here. Hi! Our class just ended. That's why I went here immediately. It is banana. Will you please look at my phone and see if there's a message? Yeah, sure. We have a message from Kelsey. She said, Babe, I promise I will go to your house after our practice. I also told our professors about your donation. Take care. I love you. Friendly get-togethers Are turning into visions of forever If I just believe this foolish heart of mine I can't pretend That I'm just a friend Cause I'm thinking maybe we were meant 
to be. I think I fall in, fall in love. Can you please text Kelsey? Um, sure. What should I say? Ask her if she's still coming. She already replied. She said, yes, babe. Wait for me. Now. I'll wait for Kelsey. She says she's coming. If she's coming, she should have texted you, right? It's too late. You should rest now. Go home now. I must leave. Okay, that is going to fetch me. Thank you. You're welcome. Where's Riley? You just finished eating lunch and now he's sleeping. I think you must come back late. You've been taking care of him? Of course. You're not here when you need to do the most. Don't you know you waited for you last night? You also have a promise, but the shoes were. You didn't fulfill the promise. How dare you talk to me like that? You don't have the right to judge me. Not just because you are the one taking care of him doesn't mean you're afraid of him. Kelsey, Riley is blind now. And you're making it worse by hurting his feelings every time. I'm not saying that I'm a hero here. I'm just saying that I'm your man needed me. Not only good times, but also in bad times. I think you should start asking yourself that. Cut? Babe, it's me. I'm sorry for not coming last night. But you promised me. But why? One of the actors fell down on stage where we were practicing. We brought him to the hospital. I'm sorry, babe. I didn't fulfill my promise. Sorry, babe. It's okay. They understand now. Next time, if you have an emergency, just tell me, okay? I will. Get some water. Riley, what happened? I just tried to stand the door. What happened? Where have you been? You're leaving Riley alone? I just went to the kitchen to get some water. Let's go to your room.
I'm sorry, Kathy. I didn't take the shot yet. I'm just worried about trying it. You know, it's the only relative I have. It's okay, Ate. You see, I'm just sad for my best man. I know he's suffering and I don't know how to make him happy. Your care for Riley is enough to make him happy. Thank you very much. Babe, I prepared the merienda. Thank you, babe. Welcome. That's it. Mm. Yummy. <laughs> you too, babe. Mm -mm. Ay, sorry. Can I sorry. Thank you, babe. Welcome! Sorry Riley, I need to do this. Ma'am, I'm still alive. <laughs> you can say walking time take this, you naughty boy. Of course, ma'am. By the way, ma'am, Kelsey. Ma'am, this is Kelsey, my girlfriend. Hi. I'm glad to meet you, Tiba. So, you're Kelsey. We finally met. Call me ma'am from now on, okay? Okay, ma'am. Ma'am, I miss you so much. Come I miss on. you too. Let's eat. I'm hungry. Okay. the good news. I have to go. Okay, Doc. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Just make 
Philippines, okay? By the way, they are carrying them under chapter 3 of their thesis. Yes, ma'am, we did. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. I'll see you next time. Guys, thanks for accepting me. No problem. Maybe we should have our next overnight at your right. Sure, we would love that. Prepare a lot of foods, okay? <laughs> Come on. Bye. Who is so talking? Why are you so long? I'm excited. Come on, let's do it. Guys, you've waited so long. Sorry. Who called me? Gold? No one called you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Simon the killer. Yeah. How rude he is. I'm done crying. That kind of news made me mad. Where's the justice? By the way, guys, are you hungry? Yes, I said finally. I'm so hungry. <laughs> okay, just eat me here, okay? I prepared some merienda. Okay. So hungry, my God.
miss my auntie so much. She loved me now. Then also Kelsey. So don't leave me, okay? I promise I will never leave you. But Riley, you will never know if it's true until the truth comes. Sorry about last night, if I left you guys. You understand now, we... I'm very scared that night, so I went home. You miss your ate so much, Riley? Yeah. Because you're talking to her. No, I'm talking to Kat. Kat? Kat is already dead. What? Kat is already dead. Will you take care of Riley until I come back? Oh, sure. No problem. Um, can you tell Kat to go here after you leave? Why? Um, I just want to apologize, sir, for what I said. Apologize? Or you're gonna kill her? No. I'm gonna kill you instead. Stop kidding, Kelsey. I'm not kidding. What are you doing here? 